Got one. Whoa. 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 We've all seen the meme, you have a few hours to catch one fish and win a bunch of cash or go to jail for a long time. What are you throwing? And this bait is that one bait for me. This thing is a fish catching machine. This probably comes as no surprise to probably all of you guys based on the title or based on the fact that you've been following the channel for quite some time because you've seen me fish this bait nonstop. Like my life depends on it. The bait I'm talking about is the Donkey Tail Jr. from Mule Fishing. The Donkey Tail Jr. is a small, ultralight, multi-species bait. It is super durable, similar to Elastec Z-Man plastics. They're buoyant, so they float. My favorite thing about this bait is you can catch all several kinds of fish. I've caught bass, different kinds of bluegill, catfish on these baits. I've seen people catch uh, chain pickerel, pikes on them and it's, it's a, it is a true multi-species bait. It does come in several colors. You can see most of them here. I like to put them in a multi-pack so that it's easier to carry around. But that's enough talking about it. It's time to go fishing and show you guys why I love this bait so much. All right, so this is what we're throwing today. We're gonna be throwing the green pumpkin donkey tail on a purple mule jig, the 164th ounce. I like to throw ultralight jigs with the Donkey Tail Jr. Specifically, the um, mule jigs because obviously they're made for them. So there's several ways to work it. Generally, I'll start by, oh, already got bit. Already got bit. Ooh, it's taking me way out there. Too much drag. There we go. And that's how quick it works. That quick little little cast just got me the first fish of the day. Oh my gosh, this guy's a monster. Look at this guy. It's a nice size bluegill out here. Just a complete tank of a bluegill. So yeah, just that fast already on a fish this is a big bluegill look at this guy probably a 10 inch or i'm hard it's hard pressed to say if it is or isn't and that's literally how fast you get on them there he goes so that's one of the reasons why i like using this lure is you can get on fish very quickly but there are several ways to work this lure. Usually when I hit someplace, I'll do a slow retrieve and then give it a couple twitches. And that's usually pretty well, but you can also just start slow rolling it in because that tail on the paddle tail is going to move. It does come in a bunch of different colors. My favorite are the pasture fire and the karma color. This green pumpkin is something I just started using recently. Oh, I just had a hit. Got one. Yep, got one. Got another guy. This wind makes it really hard to tell when they're hitting, but there he is. So far, all we've gotten is, is into some bluegill. Look at that guy. Smaller than the last guy but still a decent hit. Let's let him go over here. Uh-oh, wrong way, buddy. Go that way. There he goes. Now I've used this bait year round. It catches fish for me in the winter time. It catches fish for me, obviously in the spring time, which we're in now. And it catches fish for me in the summer and in the fall. In the winter time, I, I will put some scents on it. Use whatever scent you prefer. I like to use Procure. And it does help. Oop, got one. That was such a light bite. That's a largemouth bass right there. Yeah, buddy. That's number three on the trip. Man, he is fat. Look at that. Ooh, barely hooked too. Look how thick this little guy is. A little chunky boy. No, 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 nope. Oh, there he went. 
He's gone, fell out of my hand. And I mean, I don't even need to start telling you guys why I fish ultralight. I mean, I get an hour at a time. I don't get to have like huge, like two, three, four hour long sessions when I'm fishing. If I did, I'd probably use more traditional bass tackle. But because of the short amount of time I get, I just use, I do ultralight fishing. And this is my go-to plastic for ultralight fishing. Oh. Is that a fish or a snag? That's a snag. The only time I ever lose a plastic is when this happens and I get snagged. And you know what? I knew I shouldn't have cast over here. I know there's a snag here. Uh, oh, nope, broke off. Darn it. Only time I ever lose one is when I break off. We're gonna switch up colors this time. Let's go with the, actually, let's go with the pasture fire. Here we go. Got one. Yep. Look at that. Oh, look at that. This one's a nice one. It's probably a bluegill. Oh. Yep. Fighting like a bluegill. Look at this one. This one has a cool color pattern. It's got some spots on it. Look at this guy. Go ahead and put him back in. I already got one. I already got one. Oh, this is a good one. Another bluegill. Might even be the same one. No, this one's definitely bigger. Look at this guy, just a toad. Just a toad of a bluegill. Sheesh, they are huge in here. Look at him, big. He's a big guy. Another one. Jeez. They're not even waiting anymore. Goodness, they are hungry, hungry, hungry. That was like instant. All I did was hit. I saw my line twitch and I knew I had one. Look at this guy. Beautiful colors. I'm gonna get you free and then I'm gonna put you back in the water, all right? Got one. Oh, yes. Another one. Look at this big old freaking bluegill. Look at this guy. Ooh, he's very orange. Put him back. <clears throat> yep. Oh, wow. Another one. <laughs> this one's got a lot of orange on the breast. Got it. Oh, the tiniest, the smallest guy today. Look at this little guy, little cutie. Go be free. Got one. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh man, this guy's running. Oh, he broke off. Darn it, had too much drag on it. I can't leave after that now. One more, man. Oh, that was a big guy. Got one. Not letting this guy go, not letting this guy go. Oh, this little guy's a big guy too. Oh yeah, last fish of the day. Another bluegill. Look at this guy, beautiful, 
Got it on the donkey tail junior. Let's get a release on him. Oh. That was supposed to be more graceful. <laughs> and on that one, we're gonna call it a day. Like I said, I catch almost all my fish on this bait. If you have limited amount of time, this is what you wanna throw. It catches everything. It's a true multi-species lure. And you can get it all at mulefishing.com. They didn't sponsor this video at all. I don't get any money for them. Ethan's just a really good friend and just like me, he wants to get more people out there fishing and having fun. And this is the easiest way to do it. This is the easiest way to get into soft plastics is with this one specifically, because it's so easy to fish. So go ahead, go get yourself some. I'll leave a link in the description. Tell Ethan that I sent you. Thank you for watching. Have a good one.